today, the second hour is about speed and agility. And you have to have room to do this stuff. You know, we're not always able to go outside. So let's bring it inside. This is a facility that we did um, in Texas, in Amarillo. Um, I mean, there's not a, it's the weight rooms without any equipment in it. As I've heard some people describe it to me. Oh, you see, you're the guy that designs those weight rooms without any equipment in it. Well, there's equipment in it. It's just set up to where I can actually coach everybody in there and I can get them moving. Okay? It's a nice facility we put in up in Oregon um, at Ridgeview High School. They, two years later, they won the state championship in Oregon. And I've got a guy up here who's a testimonial down in uh, Georgia, has been doing the programs, and they were 11-2 and two this year. Had a great year, almost completely injury-free. Or you just put this place in in the Bay Area. So again, I can lift and I can move. I'm not just moving, I'm not just lifting. I'm lifting and moving, okay? So get that, this is the message I'm sending my people, the 14 year olds that are highly impressionable. Uh, coach, you talk about moving all the time and all we do is X, fill in the X. You guys know what I'm talking about? Okay, we gotta move. If you're gonna make, get mad at me on Friday night because I can't get from A gap to B gap to C gap to D gap to E gap now, I gotta play outside the numbers with some of these teams that are running this basketball in the grass, okay? You gotta get quicker and faster on defense. You gotta get quicker and faster on offense to run that offense. How do you do it from January to August? How do you prepare them?